Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Seasons um, Ambitions Edition. Uh, we're back to Episode 6. It looks like uh, Chance was pretty lucky, or pretty successful in uh, doing his prank, because Finn's hair is now purple. So I'm still sending them off to bed. They're going to get up in the morning and we'll get going. But I just thought it was funny to end the day. And I missed it right when it was ending. So when we come back, everybody will be up and ready to start the next day. Be back in just a second. Okay, everybody's up except for Finn. He's still taking his time over there, but um, the women are actually taking care of the laundry. And it looks like, Sarah, you are done. What if you need something? Well, you really don't need that much to eat, but you can have something quick. The carpool's about to come. Chance is going ahead, and he's starting off on his, finishing up his homework. He didn't have much to do. And I have Jillian checking the weather. Uh, maybe not, because she's about to go. Sorry, old woman, you can't eat. You're too slow. So, <laughs> anyway... Alright, so Chance, you've got a little bit of time left, and you should be finishing up your homework now. I've got Brighton over here inventing something so he can actually start selling. And, okay, good. We've got sunny days today and tomorrow. I'm not going to have any rain until Sunday, and that's when fall's going to start. So, pretty good. Alright. Um, Jillian, you need to go on to work. Sarah, you ought to go to work. Are you just going to sit there? Woman? Do you do this at work every day? Okay, go on. Jillian, it's your turn. Go ahead and change and go to work. You're a workaholic. You should go quickly. Chance looks like he's done. He can actually eat because he... Ah, oh, stop it. I don't want to go with you. All right, he can actually get something to eat before he leaves. And that'll at least get him in a good mood. He'll be okay. What's he disgusted by? What's dirty? It must be the sink. Yeah, you could clean it. So we could actually have you... Oh, she got her... I'm so sorry for the old woman. That's okay. Brighton will eat it. So, Brighton, you're going to go ahead and eat that cereal. Not like you really need it. Ben, you got to go. you got to go quickly. Unfortunately, you're not that hungry. I guess you had all that hot dog from the hot dog eating contest, and that's kept you okay. But, yep, it's time for you to go. But he'll wait till you get out of the shower. Brighton, what are you making? Brighton has available architectural... We need to quit that job. I'm sorry. Did you learn how to do something? Did you really learn how to do something? No, wait, that's not the right person. Yes, he learned something. He's the only one with skills. I love it. Okay, so finally we got somebody doing something. What did you make? Well, whatever he made, it's not going to give us a whole lot of money, but if he keeps doing it, he'll actually make us something. All right. He's still got a lot of scrap, though, doesn't he? Yeah, he's got plenty. All right. Ben. They're not going to wait forever. Chance, you got to go. All right, this old woman, she needs to be... Why don't you grade the boss's paperwork? That'll get you in a good favor. Let's see. She doesn't need the power work. She needs to meet co-workers. Still doesn't know her co-workers? Good job. Good job, Brighton. All right, you go ahead and eat, and then you're going to come back over here, and you can do some more. Um, we could invent. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and invent. Hopefully you won't catch fire. Chance, go to school. You don't have to clean anything. Alright, let's see. Finn, what is he going to do? He needs to... Let's do the boss's paperwork. I don't know what you need to do for your job, but... Oh, he needs logic. I keep forgetting. Man. Alright. You are not skipping school. <laughs> see, he looked at me like, What do you mean? Alright, go ahead and go to school. You need to meet some new friends. And... Let's see. I don't think... Have we seen the school? I think we have. Let's go with him to school, because I want to see the school here in Twinbrook. It's, it's been a while since I've actually played in Twinbrook. I do like it, but I don't like it. It's kind of... You just... You have to get used to the fact that you won't have as many things to do, because you can't put as many things in the town. But I do like it. I think, overall, it's a nice town. One thing we do need to do is we want to take them down to go swimming in the... It's not really an ocean. It's just a... I guess it's a brook. No, it's a big lake. So we'll take him down tomorrow on the weekend and have him at least go there. Yeah, I think we saw the, the school. It is nice. It is pretty. And it does give you that same, uh, more of a southern look. Very, very old south kind of look. So pretty nice. All right, we don't want to go there. Go on in there and learn something. Don't be like this kid. This idiot out here who won't go into school. I hope you get in trouble. All right, so let's go back and see. Now, Sarah is working here, too, so we don't need to really go with her. Did we freeze? Yes, we froze. Come on, get in there. 
Okay, he's finally going. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at Jillian, where she's working at. And she's in the business career, and you know the business career always looks the same. It's basically the same building. They just usually recolor it, make it look a little bit different, but not too much. But you can kind of see it's the same thing. Whoops, I went too far. All right, don't spin around that fast. But they at least changed it. I don't think I've ever seen this in front of the, the business center. So that's normally something in front of the science center. But it's nice. It's just something a little different. And then, of course, good old Finn, who is working in the medical career. Um, the hospital is the same as any other place. But they did give it a little bit different color. And they just did some landscaping out here. So it's nice. Everything in Twinbrook seems to be very pastel. Uh-oh, we got an alien ship right over here. Can we steal it? No. Is anybody? Nobody's a klepto. Man. Okay, Brighton, you are now at a level two, and you just made something. Let's see what you got. He made the drinking llama. All right, you're still inventing? You keep on going, because we're going to take this over to the consignment store, and we're going to get ourselves some money. Jillian has met all of her coworkers. Well, it's about time. Now, we need to... Um, yeah, let's build up some relationships here. Chat with your coworkers because you may you may need these people later on. I guess we, uh, with Brighton, we really don't need to worry about that. But I want to change his job to inventor. In order to do that, we're going to have to take him downtown. So yeah, we don't want to worry about his jobs he's got. So we'll take him down here and have him register because you got to do this anyway. And we'll have him register as an inventor, and then that way he'll get the um, he'll get all these taken off. And you won't have to worry about that. All right, then you're good. Everybody else is good. We can go back to the festival, but I think we saw pretty much everything yesterday. Um, there's a few things I wanted to do, like the tanning bed, so we'll go do that maybe, maybe before we go to the to the lake tomorrow. All right, Brighton, are you done? So once you finish this one, I want you to go sell. You want to take a photo in a photo booth? Oh man, he's catching fire! Stop. Go put yourself out, buddy. Go put yourself out. Don't be an idiot. Don't just stand there and hop around and burn to death. Go put yourself out. You got 52 minutes before you die. Well, that's going to put you in a real good mood. See, that's the one thing you have to worry about with the inventor bench, because or the workbench. Um, <laughs> well, get in there. He can catch fire, and if you don't catch him in time, he can die. So, all right, he. That destroyed what we had set up for him, so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and send him back over here, let him register as self-employed, and then we're going to take him once he's done from there. Where's the consignment store? It's not here, it's not here, it's not here. Okay, it's one of these. That's the fire station. No, that's the consignment store. We'll go here. Which I don't know that I've ever been in this one. I can't remember it offhand, so Brighton, get moving. Let's go, because I want to see the consignment store. I know the one that we normally get in the bin and that normally gets put in your city. I've, I've seen that all the time. And I've seen the one that comes with pets. I've used it a couple of times. But this one, for some reason, I just don't remember if it's anything different or not. I think it is, because I think all of them are different. Oh, stop it. I want to go with you. And stop calling us. We don't want to talk to anybody. <laughs> all right. Yeah, we do want to go swimming in this big lake. So... I think there's only one little beach area that we can get to it, so we'll do that tomorrow. I ought to take him back to the gym and let him work out before he goes to the beach, but maybe we will. I definitely want to get him, uh, let's see, let's just get the inventor career. No, he just wants to improve. We want to collect scrap. Let's see. Well, there's really not too much else that you want to do. We can get rid of that. We can get rid of that. But we do want to do that. All right, go on in here. This is City Hall for Twinbrook. Obviously, it's exactly the same as City Hall from Sunset Valley, just a little bit of a change in the way it's designed, or the way it's colored. But it's the exact same thing. So, in the name of science, gain a skill level in inventing. All right. We can do that because we're going to get some money. So, yeah, that's fine. We will do that. Yeah, we want to be an inventor. I didn't even check the responsibilities. That's okay. Yes, we're going to quit that horrible career. I don't normally give up on things, but that would be a great career if I was just playing the game with one sim. But when you're playing with more than one, it's a little bit tough. All right, Chance, you got somewhere to go after school today, so i got to make sure I don't forget. All right, Brighton, buddy, go. Where are we going? It's not that side. It's this side over here. Maybe he'll just walk. Maybe he won't have to actually get in the car or anything. 
Yeah, I think that's it right there. So yeah, I, I don't remember seeing that one, to be honest with you. I really don't. I mean, I'm sure I've been in on it before. Uh, Sarah's gone. She's going home. Jillian's going home. I'm sure I've been in here, but I don't know. Okay, as a self-employed professional inventor, spend your nights out gathering scrap from junkyards and trash cans and your days hunched over your workbench. Okay, once you've discovered something awesome, don't be ashamed to turn out many more of it to turn a big profit. Get over here, buddy, and let's sell something. And in order to sell, you have to push buy, and then you go in there and you can start consigning. All right. We could buy things here if we want that would be cheaper, but we are trying to make money, not spend money. Somebody got a raise. I don't know who it was. Sarah got a raise. Very nice. She's a teacher's aide, and she made a bonus of 240 simoleons, making 24 simoleons an hour. Good job, Sarah. Still slow, but that's okay. Come on, Brighton. Sell your stuff. You don't have much to sell. All right, let's consign. <laughs> He's got one thing to sell for four dollars. That's not going to be a whole lot. We're not going to make any money, but that's okay. All right, buddy, you going home? All right, and then we're going to see if you can make some more things. All right, Jillian, you're on your way home. No, you're not. You're going to come over here because I'm going to send you. It's summertime. I'm going to send you over to the tanning bed right here. So let's have you come here. At least get you before you get all the way there. And. Yeah, I know it's going to cost us money. It's 90 simoleons. That's an awful lot of money. But while you're here, you can do that, and you can collect flowers as well. Ben, you're out of work. That's fine. And we'll see if it comes out okay, because you can have a disaster in the tanning bed, and you can actually have it turn out good. Somebody else got a raise. Fantastic. Let me get these set up for her so she has something to do. And let's see. I thought I saw another one. Maybe not. You got everything? I guess she does. Got everything from over here? You could collect that. You collect that little seed, whatever it is. It's, I don't know. May not be anything. We may never even do gardening, but that's okay. All right, where are you, woman? Let's see. Is she on? Well, she's here finally. Let's find out who else got a raise. Who else did a good job? I bet it was Finn. Yeah, Finn got another raise. He's a bedpan cleaner, and he got a bonus of 264 simoleons. He makes 25 simoleons an hour. I'm going to stop and pause for a minute because I want to actually watch her do this. Let's see. Brighton, you should not be sitting here looking like an idiot. Um, why don't you go ahead and pay the bills, which is 98 simoleons, and then I'm going to have you invent something. And the rest of you guys, you've got to fend for yourselves. Chance, you're going to go ahead and come on home. No, wait. You need to go research, so let's cancel that out. And let's go to Jillian. Yeah, I would have forgotten about that, and he wouldn't have been able to research until Monday, and I don't want to deal with that. All right, woman, get in there, and let's see if you get a good result or if it just looks horrible. Let's see, what does she want to do? You want to see the chance earn an A? That would be nice. Oh, wait, she wanted something to do with money. What does she want? Be worth more than 25000 Well, you're close, so yeah, why not? Then what do you want? You want to buy a hot tub to put out in the low, end, the low rent side of town? I don't think so. All right, what happened? How did she do? Okay. I don't really see much of a difference for her, but she was pale to begin with. So, but that's fine. She didn't come out with a disaster, so that's good. All right, you go ahead, answer your phone too, and then we'll catch up with Brighton, make sure that he's, he's still just now paying the bills. Buddy, they weren't kidding when they said loser. Took you that long just to walk down and pay your bills. All right, the woman over here is not doing so hot, but you know, she could actually make dinner for the rest of the family. That would be nice instead of looking out the window. Lunch, it's actually dinner time. Here, make autumn salad so you don't burn anything down. Then you, you're actually in a good mood. Why don't you go out and do something? I could have you learn logic. That would be the smart thing. Um, but you don't have any books here, so tell you what. Yeah, you want to do laundry? That's fine. You go ahead and do that while I find out where the library is. It's right here. I don't think we've ever actually ever been in the library, so you go ahead and do this. Laundry will wait. I do like the library. I like the whole look of it. It's very nice. Come on. Get over there. I'd like to see the inside, though. I can't remember if we went inside or not. Brighton is beginning to... Oh, he's sick. That's okay. He's the only one that's actually got any skills, so keep working.
don't catch on fire again. Although he's a loser, which means he's very quick to catch on fire. So I need to be, and he's clumsy. You know, I, I really set this guy up for failure. Okay, come on, Finn. Get on over here because I want to see the library. Actually, it probably will let me get in there now. Yeah, I don't think we've seen it. I would have remembered this. So, okay, they've got a computer here in the front room. Oh, it's very, very dark. It's got this dark room back here. Let's see. Where are the skill books? And I'm going to have to pause because otherwise it will take me forever. Let me find. doesn't look like skill books are here. It may be that Twinbrook is the town that doesn't have them as well because there's two towns so far I know that do not have the skill books. And if that's the case, we're in we're in bad shape because we don't have any. Oh, wait, maybe it's this one right here. It looks like kids' books, though. Yeah, those are kids' books. Well, this is not going to be good. We're going to have to go out and buy a book. Yeah, we may just have to go buy a book. Or actually, we could buy a telescope, and he could do it that way. Or, yeah, we could do that. Let's go ahead and buy a telescope. So, I'm sorry. We're all over the place. Go into build buy mode, and we are going to get... Uh, let's go to skills. Let's get ourselves a telescope. We won't get the expensive one. We'll get the cheapest one we can get, which is not that cheap. Um, let's see. There it is, right there. It's 600. It's not too bad. Okay, we need to put this somewhere out here where we can get to it. I don't want the burglars to come up and get it, but that's okay. Um, I can move the table. I just got an awful lot of stuff out here. I don't think they can get around that if I put it there. Maybe they can. Mm. Let's see. Yeah, I think they can get around that. That should give them plenty of room. All right, so Finn, sorry, you're coming back home and you're going to do this. This will actually be pretty easy. Now, the only problem with this is what Ambitions released was they have the whole Meteor deal. So if you look through this, you run a higher risk of actually, um, of actually bringing down the Meteor to destroy your house or kill your sims. But it's rare. It doesn't happen very often. It did happen in one of my other LPs. So if you're watching Showtime, you saw that happen. But with that one, we didn't do anything. It just happened randomly. All right. Chance, you got to finish up researching, come home. You don't have to really get your homework done until Sunday, but that's okay. Jillian, you're playing soccer? Well, you don't want to be with the family either. All right. Let's go ahead and see what you're doing then. Did you pick your flowers? I hope you did because we need the money. Yeah, you did. So while you do that, I'm going to look and see if any flowers came up over here. And since this is where Chance was picking them up, were they right here? I think they were. Maybe they were down a little bit. Maybe. Nope, doesn't look like it. I guess they just spawned in one location at a time. Now that's the really, uh, let's go ahead and pick up that mushroom. And here's another flower. Yeah, it's just this, once I found this little trick of selling the flowers, I mean, that's just easy money. You might as well do it, and then that way we can get out of the swamps and move over to a nice house eventually. Because I don't like to actually do anything to cheat and get them into a better house early. I like them to earn it, but however they earn it is completely up to them. All right, if there's no flowers over here, okay. I'm just going to make sure because I don't want to pass up any any money here. Yeah, it looks like she's good. All right, woman, did you finish? Oh, she finished dinner. Look at her. She's about to drop. All right, tell you what you can do. Why don't you go ahead and put that away instead of just sitting there looking at it? And it's only 7 o'clock. You really don't need to go to bed. We don't have a TV, I don't think, so there's really nothing she can do. Um, but you can go ahead and do that, then you can clean up. Why don't you clean this kitchen? I know, that's awful to make you do it, but... You have been making a mess, and this gives you something to work on. Ben, you're working on your logic skill. I like it. Brighton, are you done? No, you need the bathroom. Okay. You go ahead and do that. Jillian, when you're done, you're going to go ahead and come on home. And let's see. She could actually, well, you have her move clothes. I think Jillian needs to be working on a skill, too. Sarah, what do you need to work on? Just your mood. Well, can't help you there. Um, oh, Jillian, you need to really work on your boss. So tell you what, when you get home, why don't you call your boss? It's not him. That's just your coworkers. Let's see. Let's call. Oh, her boss is Harwood Clay. Why don't you go ahead and chat with him a couple of times? And that will at least improve it a little bit. Okay, Chance, you're going to get home. You're already home. 
tell you what, so we don't have to worry about you for the rest of the weekend. Do your homework. And then you can eat something in just a minute. And eat your leftover autumn salad that your grandmother made. Okay, grandmother, you, you go ahead. Let's see. Oh, there's more laundry to do. Yeah, you're tired, but you're working. And then Brighton, big old geek, come on over here and uh, invent something. I like you, Brighton. I do. But you're tired, too. But you know what? That's just too bad. You've got to do something more. Did you make anything, though? You didn't make anything? Oh, he's used a lot of his scrap, so we're going to have to go back out tomorrow. I'm going to sell this newspaper for nothing. So we're going to have to go over there and do that. This is his architect portfolio, which <laughs> we don't need it anymore. Sarah's feeling a little bit ill. Well, that's okay. She can still do laundry. Um, Alright, let's go ahead and while she's on there, uh, 75 simoleons for this wildflower. Let's see how much we got here. 80 for this one. Alright, Brighton's up to level 3, so it didn't take him long to get higher up there. $30 for this wildflower. Let's see what we got here. 200 for this one. Nice. And let's get rid of this. Alright. Now this mushroom, we could sell it for 41. I don't know what else we would need it for. I know you need it in Supernatural, so I'm going to leave it alone for now. Alright, old woman, I know you're tired. You can go to bed. You've been up long enough. What did you make? You didn't tell us? Oh, he made a new invention, the dog toy. Okay. Now, what we ought to do, he's got his skill up to level 3. Brighton, you are kind of hungry, so why don't you go eat something? And then it's getting, it's not too late, but you're going to actually end up being exhausted. I'm going to let you shower and then go to bed. All right, and let's see. Jillian, when you're done, you would probably be okay. You could get by. We'll just go ahead and send you to bed because we want to get up early tomorrow and go to the, to the lake. Chance, you need to finish up your homework, buddy. How much more do you have to do? You ought to be getting close. <laughs> no, that's okay. We'll let you get as close as you can, then you can go to sleep as well after you eat. Then, what have I got you doing? You working on this for a while? How far did you get? Okay, you're up to one. You need to go up to at least a level four in order to get your job going. And let's see, is there anything else you need? No, logic's the only thing you need. Jillian just needs to work on her boss. Brighton, you just need to be inventing stuff. Sarah, just work on your mood. And Chance, poor little boy. He's got a B. He's doing pretty good. He's almost got his homework done. Alright. Sounds like laundry is done. Looks like a pretty decent place for them to get finished up. So what I'm going to do is let them finish up the night. Um, good. Ben's up to a level 2. Very nice. I want to make sure that he's not about to bust. Does he need anything? He could probably eat before he goes to bed. And I could get rid of this easel. But, you know, Brighton could finish it up and we could sell that and make some money. Alright, Sarah, how are you doing with your boss? Have you improved your relationship at all? Yeah, it's gone up a little bit. Not by much. And when you look at her career, it's still pretty bad. So, yeah, it's just bad. That's okay. You'll get there, and when we start going back to work from now on, you're just going to be working, trying to suck up to the boss. Chance, finish up. That way you can go to bed, and we don't have to worry about homework for the rest of the weekend. Is this dirty? No, you can't clean. No, you could clean it. Brighton? No, I'm not going to make you clean. I want to make you clean, but I won't. All right, she's not too tired. She can clean it. I know, buddy, but go eat. Go eat. You're going to be starving. Do it. Then, oh, he's having no fun. I'm sorry. We're going to have fun tomorrow. Mom, get off the phone. I know you want to talk to this guy. Okay. I'm surprised we haven't got robbed being that we have an unlucky sim because that normally does it. But I don't know. Maybe it'll happen eventually. Ben, I probably ought to let you stop. He's, he's kind of hungry, so let's go ahead and get him taken care of. Well, he's not too bad, but if not, he'll be the one that'll sleep in all day. So we'll go ahead and let you eat and go to bed. Yeah, get in there and sleep. What's wrong with you? Yeah, he, he can't do much more. Everything else is good, but he can't do anything else. Jillian, you really need to finish up and go to sleep. I should have let you eat, but you'll be okay till the morning. Chance, poor little guy. 
And Sarah, you're going to need everything in the morning. That's a darn shame. But hopefully you'll get up early and we get you started early. All right, I'm going to go ahead and cut out here. And then when we come back, we'll be ready to head out to the actual lake and spend a little bit of time at the lake for the last weekend of the summer. So I'll be back in just a second. Okay, everybody's getting back up. And Brighton got an opportunity that he has to run off. Um, he's got to go off to the science facility for something. I just said yes to it. It didn't matter what. Uh, he's competing, or he's going to actually... Let's see, it says he's going over there to do some kind of promotion. He's going to talk about his inventing talents. All right, so he's going to go over there, and he's already got the skill done, so all he has to do is just walk over there and get it done. The rest of the family, Sarah got something to do, and Finn has something to do, but it's not until later. But we're sending them all over to the actual... Um, oh, my gosh, everybody's sick. I think everybody's sick except for the old woman. So, And she's probably next. No, she's sick. He's sick. He's sick. She's sick, and oh, no chance. The only one that's not sick. Good deal. They're going over to River Junction Beach, which is actually the only beach here in Twinbrook, and I don't know that I've ever been to it. I've seen it, but I've never actually gone down there because there really isn't anything there, and I don't think I added anything either. Normally, I would add something into the town, especially at the beach, but for this one, I don't think I did anything at all, but that's okay because now at least we can go in the water and they can spend a little bit of time I think Sarah has until 10 o'clock oh actually she's got to go now so she can actually go and lead a field trip so once we get there I'm going to send her off to go get this done and then Finn has to wait until noon and then he can go over and actually um, do his activities so Sarah you go ahead and go on over to the field trip and we're going down here to the beach okay I mean, it's, it's got that dirty sand, so it's not going to be your white, pretty, uh, really nice beach, but it's a beach nonetheless. So now they can go down the stairs, but I guess they don't want to. Then you have just about 30 minutes. So let's go ahead and bring everybody over here, at least everybody that's here, and we'll send them into the water. Okay. Oh, he can play in the sand? Oh yeah, you're going to play in the sand. And Brighton, when you're done, you go to, you're going to go ahead and come on over here, too. All right, Jillian, why don't we go ahead? It's still the last day of summer. Why don't you go ahead and go swimming? Then I really don't want you to swim because you've only got a few minutes. So maybe you can... Let's see, what can you do? Oh, you're hungry. Why don't you go ahead and serve up something? Serve up hot dogs. I don't think you have to go anywhere because there's nowhere to go. Yeah, you just magically come up with them, so that's pretty nice. But yeah, you can actually get in the water here from the beach, and it's pretty. It's really nice. I like this area over here, um, but I don't ever go there very often. But it's the only place that you can go and actually swim. All right, Jillian, get on out there. What were you going to do? Following the leader. Oh, yeah, we need to disband the group. Which, yeah, okay. It didn't matter. We didn't spend a whole lot of time. They were happy. And I want to see, let's see, Jillian, I want you to get over here and lounge for a little bit. No, you don't have a lounge in your inventory. That's why you can't do it. I think Brighton has it. No, maybe it's Chance. I knew somebody had it. All right, so why don't we let Chance go ahead and give that to Jillian. Jillian, now you should be able to lounge. Yeah. And then I want to take a look closer in on Chance and see how he's doing. Oh, he made a little star. Very nice. <laughs> and then he destroyed it. I like it. Okay, I never knew that they could do it. I'm... I never play the children for very long, actually for their days off. Normally we were always busy doing other things, but let's see what else he's going to make. Jillian, are you going to float? No, you're just going to swim. You go ahead. She's swimming out there quite a distance. I don't know if you can see her. You can see her head out there. Go ahead and float, woman. All right, there she goes. She's floating. Okay, we can actually zoom out there and see her a little bit. It's actually nice. It's very peaceful. You can look back behind and let's see what it looks like from the, from the water. So yeah, it's actually something to do. It's good. Like I said, there's really not a whole lot for them to do at the beach, but that's okay. Brighton, why don't you go ahead and come on out here. You don't have a float either. I don't think any... Oh yeah, Sarah's got one. You can give it to Brighton. Let's see. Give it to Brighton. So Brighton, you can come on out here and you can float. Oh, that's the old woman. Brighton, you come out here and you can float here. And then Jillian, I want you to continue floating, so you're going to float when you get done. All right, Sarah, you should be getting 
What are you doing? You didn't take the trip? You're an idiot. She's chatting with somebody. So you got to watch them because they will forget what they're supposed to do. Ben, uh, yeah, he was kind of hungry. So that's okay. You need to go compete in the riddle contest before time ends. Mm. And let's see, does he have... I think he's the one who also has a float. We'll give that one to Chance. So Chance can get in the water too. All right, Chance, let's go to you. See what you're making. Okay, you made a little castle. That's pretty cool. And who are all these people? Alma Drill. And who are you, lady? Charlotte Dismarias. Oh, here's a little friend you could actually meet. Um, but you're, too, you're too excited to destroy things, so I don't want to disturb you there. So let's go back out here. Jillian, where are you going? What are you going to go do? Oh, you're going to go talk to somebody? Okay, that's fine. You go talk to him. We'll see what Brighton's doing. Brighton, how far are you going to go out there? Now, that's not the downtown area. That's just the other side. Get in there. Get on your float. So, yeah, it's nice. It's um, it's a little different. It's very peaceful. So, But I do like this area over here. We need to go over here on one of our days. Um, I don't think we have too much to do today, though. It's kind of a, a lazy late summer day and she's still trying to get out of the water all right chance why don't we let you swim for a little bit we'll let you come out here and lounge and then Ben you're okay the woman uh, Sarah you're over here at the science center if I haven't shown the science facility this I believe this is the back of it but it's over here kind of in the bad area of town it's just this one little strip and this is the front area. This is one thing I don't like about it, is that they didn't actually make the front uh, the front sidewalk connect to the street. But I, mean, if that's my biggest complaint, okay, no big deal. But it just my OCD just kind of wants it to connect. <laughs> but that's all right. Now Brighton uh, Finn is actually over here at the bookstore, and we haven't actually looked at the bookstore, but it's I think it's right there by is that the grocery store? Yeah. So it's really, it's just the same thing as what you have in Sunset Valley, just a different color scheme of it. So, but it's nice. Now, he could have actually bought some books in there, but we really want to save our money. So I'm not going to spend anything on books right now, not when you can do it in other ways. Okay, Brighton, you still in the middle of the water? Oh, no, he's getting out of, he's getting out. Why are you going, what are you going to do? Oh, you're going to go destroy? You are just a piece of work, aren't you? But that's okay, we're going to watch you. Hopefully it won't hurt Chance's feelings because he's he's out there swimming. We'll come back to you before you do it. Chance, keep going because your dad is going to be a jerk. And don't look. Don't turn around. All right. Oh, I thought you were talking to an adult, Jillian. You're going to talk to the little kids? I thought you were trying to make some friends. Okay, Sarah got some increased performance on her career. Brighton, he made 500 from, oh, that, that thing we did this morning. So very nice. All right. I bet you feel all proud of yourself, don't you? Big old bully. You just a big old bully. Let's see, are you hungry? Not really. Now, I don't think there's a bathroom or anything out here either, so that's another bad thing about this beach. If you want to use it, you're probably going to have to either build a bathroom or decide where you're going to send them, because there's not one anywhere close, not that I can see. Um, so make sure you send your Sims off to the bathroom quick. All right, what are you going to do with your wife here? You're going to chat? You go ahead and chat. Sarah's finished. No, Sarah, don't go home. Go ahead and go here. Ben, looks like you're done. Oh, he made 1,500 simoleons. Definitely worth going. All right, so he solved that puzzle. Very nice. Let's go see. Look at Chance. Oh, and then we got the sun. Is it? Oh, my gosh. This is how quick the day went. It's almost sunset. So I don't think I've ever seen the sunset over here in, in Twinbrook. Now, that just... That's the only way to do it. Get away from your family. Peace and quiet. You know the crazy people over there. Oh, and now you're going to stop. Go ahead and lounge some more. What were you going to go do? Tell her a story? Nah. Let's see. Now, they could be a little bit more. Let's see. How's their relationship? Oh, they don't have much of a relationship at all. Well, I'm letting them deal with themselves. Then, why don't you... Let's see. Sarah, I think you're probably hungry. Yeah, you're a little hungry. Why don't you go ahead and grab a plate? Then you can go out and swim. You haven't done anything yet. 
I'd actually let you go pretty far out because you know what? We don't go too far out. Alright. Chances out here, all happy as can be. The sun is going down. Okay, not too many different colors, but it's it's pretty. It is pretty much a natural sunset though. So very nice. Everything's about to end for the summer. And I'm excited to see fall in Twinbrook because we've seen summer in Twinbrook all along. I've never seen anything else, so it'll be interesting to see how it changes. But that was nice. Now, I didn't even check the weather to see if they're bad. It's 53 degrees. I'd be a little cold if I was out there. But they're not getting any cold moodlets, so that's okay. All right, Jillian, you're still talking to this. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, something was happening. You can see that stance. He was not happy. All right, what's wrong with you? You need some food, too? Why don't you go over here and get something to eat? Grab a plate. Jillian, you're kind of hungry, too. Oh, you're going to play? Okay, you play. All right, that's fine. You're going to play, you play. Chance, you are hungry, so why don't you come on over here and get something to eat? And then I think you're fine. Let's go see the old man. Where's he, where's he at? Tell you what, we will give... We'll give the float over to Finn. Yeah, I think I only got three because I know the, the two elders are not going to actually last for too long. And then they're going to end up passing down their their flat, their flat inflatable lounges to whoever's left. So that's why I didn't spend a whole lot of money on getting them other things. Well, it's prettier, prettier at night, but I don't think there's any lights or anything over here at the beach. So I don't know if there's torches, so that's good. Alright, Chance, you got a long... I did send you out here pretty far. I'm sorry. Poor old man. Now, I see the spotlights over here, but that's the um, athletic facility. So let's go over and see. Is there anything going on there tonight? Um, I know there is here at the festival, but we saw the festival. Let's see if there's anything happening tonight. There's a concert. Oh, we could go to the concert. Let's send everybody to the concert. Yeah, I know it's a lot of money. and We really don't have it to spend, but... It's the weekend. It's summer. They need to have some fun. Yeah, he's probably still hungry. I don't think he got anything to eat, but that's okay. He'll ma he'll manage. All right, Ben, you got to start swimming, buddy, because they're gonna leave you. Everybody's gonna go on their own. And poor little Chance will be there by himself. All right, let's speed up. To see. Yeah, it's just one little torch out here. So definitely, if you're gonna do this, you might want to actually build something else. Oh wait, I didn't even see this up here. Just a nice little gazebo that you can come up and sit. But it's a darn shame. I'm going to put the top on it. It's pretty. But, you know, you would expect them to have some kind of a bathroom or something out here. But there's there's nothing. So I'm going to look back here again just to double check. I don't want to tell you wrong. But, yeah, there's no bathroom. Nothing for them to relieve themselves. I didn't even see over here. I wonder if we could get in this. Yeah, looks like we could. So we'll actually come back. We'll come back over here. Maybe we'll come back tomorrow. I don't know. Maybe at least one or two of them. They can come back over, and I think they can go out in all these little trails. I would assume so because it looks like you can walk on it. But it's pretty. I like Twinbrook. All right, who's here? Are you already there? Are you already done? Don't tell me the concert's over this this quick. Yeah, I think we missed it. I think we spent money on nothing. Didn't I send you in? Yeah, you saw a great concert, so you're fine. Alright, why don't we send you guys? Let's see. Nobody's really that hungry. So I don't really want to send them off to eat. But we could go over to the to the community pool. So why don't you go ahead and take your wife over there. Ben, where are you at? You're still watching the concert. Sarah, you aren't doing anything. Chance, are you heading over? You're going to, but we'll just stop that, so that way we can save a little bit of money. Let's go ahead and send them over here to go here with him, and then Ben, when you're done, you come over here. And this way we can at least take a look at the swim center. So, let's see, I think Brighton and Jillian will probably be second. I believe Sarah looked like she was ready to get there. So, alright, Brighton and Jillian are on their way. Sarah, you're already in the cab, aren't you? But you're just waiting on chance. Again, I think we tried to show this the first night. This is the diner. Very tiny, very small, but you can actually have them come out here. I don't think they can eat out here, though. At least I'm not... I don't. I know they can at the bistro, but they can't do it out here at the diner. 
All right, you guys better hurry, because I don't know how late this pool stays open. Yeah, chances curfew is in effect. Well, he's trying to get in the cab, but... Where you at, buddy? Is this you? Yeah, that's him coming. As long as he's with an adult, he can stay out as late as he wants. We're not going to stay out too late, though, because then they won't, they won't do anything tomorrow. All right, looks like everybody's doing okay on energy. Not great, but they're all, they're all fine. All right, let's go to the swim center. I don't remember going to it. I know I've been in it, but I don't remember it. So we'll take a look and see what it's actually like. Try to get all these summer things done before the weather turns nasty on us. And I don't think I put diving boards or anything in this one. I don't think I even went in and touched it. So, and I kind of regret that I didn't. Yeah, it's, um, it's nice. It's big, but it's just kind of plain. So go ahead and swim. Let's let the, everybody go over here and swim. At least for a little while. All right, you can lounge. And I think he, he doesn't have a lounge anymore. <laughs> you can fish in the pool. All right, and who is this person? Sylvia Gikel? I don't know how you say her name. Okay, this one I believe... Let's see. Yeah, they do have the bathrooms and everything inside, but there's no sitting area. It's just two big rooms of bathrooms, so it's kind of kind of plain, but not too bad. What we actually need to do is, um, if I can go in here and edit town, I need to put, of course, the diving boards in, but you'll notice there's nowhere for them to sit. There's no lounge chairs, nothing. So it seems to me it's kind of like it's very, very plain. They're missing so much. So that plus maybe some tables and a grill or something would actually make this place a little bit more, I don't know, enjoyable. You could actually probably fit the basketball court because you know I love the basketball court. You could probably fit it in over here somewhere. But right now I'm really disappointed in that there's really nothing here for them to, to do. And there's nowhere for them to sit. So my recommendation, when and if you're going to come over here, edit this lot a lot. So you're going to have to go in here and make some big changes. And I'll probably do that before we actually come back again when the season rolls around again. I'll probably make sure I go back in and fix this up. Because I bet with, I believe, summer, we have one day until fall. And I think fall actually begins in about an hour. So I don't think we're really going to really come back over here for a while. All right, I'm going to go ahead and start sending everybody home because I think they've had a pretty full day. And they've gotten quite a bit. We got to see the festival. We got to actually enjoy a little bit of the, of the um, I keep calling it a peach, a, a peach, a beach, but um, the riverfront beach or whatever it's called. So we got to see that. And we got to see the community pool. So I think we got, we got to see some, most of the things from summer. There's a few things that we probably didn't get to, but we'll get to them eventually because, like I say, it all comes back around. All right, who is this that we're going with? Who am I? Oh, I'm following the old woman. She's she's smart. She's like, I'm getting out of here as quick as I can. So, yeah, I liked Wimbrook. I'm just having to get used to where everything is and you know, finding different things to do for all of the family members because it's not as activity-based as all the other towns. So you really have to find other stuff and put things in there. That was a horse. Okay. So, but yeah, we'll do some more exploring and uh, get out and kind of find more uh, more parts of the neighborhood. All right, I'm going to go ahead and get them here, get them to bed. I want to make sure everybody makes it home. All right, Sarah, you go ahead and go to sleep because you're exhausted. All right, Ben, you're on your way and you're exhausted too. You're going to go ahead and sleep. Brighton. Brighton, you could probably go to the bathroom first. Oh, you need to unclog that and then you need to use it. Jillian, do you have enough? Oh, Jillian, you're starving. But you know what? I'll let you eat. And then I'm going to have you clean up. And by doing that, I already told you to go home. If you eat, then you clean up, you'll get all these dishes out of the way. And poor little Chance. He's okay. He just needs to go to sleep. So sounds like it's all done for the night. I'm going to go ahead and stop the part here, let them finish up and take care of their business here Saturday night. And when we get back, you'll already notice it has already started with fall. So we'll get to see how things change starting tomorrow for the, um, the first day of fall. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you next time.